Most humans may think of warm weather holidays because the best logical way to enjoy their time without work, but there's something to be stated for embracing the icy climate, too. Winter brings approximately the magic of Christmas, the adrenaline of ski runs down powerful mountains, and the romance of sleigh rides underneath the starry cold skies, while now not every European city is perfect to winter, some just flourish as the temperatures plummet. Take a have a look at our list of first-class places to visit in Europe in winter and what makes each so unique. Number 15 Budapest, Hungary Contrasted with capitals in Western Europe, Budapest is more reasonable and significantly less jam-packed in winter making it the ideal spot to visit at Christmas for those on a careful spending plan. In December, the city is home to two principal Christmas markets, Vorismarty Square and St. Stephen's Basilica. The market at the square is the biggest, with north of 100 slows down selling everything from a determination of craftwork to high-quality chocolates and the famous Mazeska Lex gingerbread. The market before the congregation is more modest however offers a skating arena and puts on a great light act with lasers projecting on the facade of the actual basilica. Budapest is well known for its warm showers and natural aquifers, and there could be no more excellent opportunity to appreciate them than in the freezing cold weather days. Assuming you're in the mood for conquering the outside all things being equal, the City Park Ice Arena, one of the most established skating arenas in Europe, is difficult to beat, with the Vajdahunyad Palace behind the scenes. Number 14 Copenhagen, Denmark, Contrasted with the remainder of Northern Europe, Denmark has milder winters with snow that normally doesn't show up until January. This makes it an extraordinary objective for city sweethearts who need to encounter the sorcery of winter with strolls by the trench in Nyham or the super well-known Kronprinsenskade Road, Copenhagen's best objective for bistros and store shops. As one of the most established event congregations in Europe, the 19th century Tivoli Nurseries merits a visit whenever of the year. In any case, the monstrous region is particularly astonishing in winter, when huge number of minuscule glimmering lights bob off the ice and snow surrounding you. Beside Tivoli Nursery's own Christmas market, you'll likewise find enormous Christmas markets at Ruler Square in Nyhavn. And, surprisingly, one inside the city zoo. Number 13 Cortina di Ampezzo, Italy Found only two hours north of Venice and may be better known for being home to the 1956 Winter Olympics, Cortina di Ampezzo is the escape to the Italian Dolomites and one of the most outstanding ski resorts in Italy. Sitting simply moves back from Lake Serapis and the Tresheim Public Park, the town is likewise a top-of-the-line objective for winter sweethearts. The colder time of year Olympics will get back to Cortina in 2026 so this moment is the ideal opportunity to visit before the groups take over once more. For experienced sweethearts, the town offers simple admittance to three skiing regions Valoria, Cristallo Maiders, Tofana, and Lagazoy 5 Tori. Additionally, there are extraordinary climbing trails you can use for snowshoeing and cross-country skiing in winter, and an Olympic ice arena to attempt ice skating and twisting. The actual town changes into a colder time of year wonderland in December, with an energetic Christmas market, renowned for its hot chestnuts and enchanting wooden cabins selling high-quality specialties. Number 12 Strasbourg, France Paris could catch the core of darlings all over, however there's a storybook French city on the German boundary that can show improvement over the nation's capital. Strasbourg gets from its neighbor to offer conventional Christmas markets, monstrous Christmas trees, and a cleaning of snow. Strasbourg is a charming middle-aged town popular for its half-wooded houses and pleasant waterways that are staggering in any season, the Franco-German influences can be seen everywhere in Strasbourg, including in its cuisine. No visit to the city is complete without sitting at a cafe near the water to taste an apple and cinnamon tarts flambés, which literally translates to pig baked in the flames, and don't let the winter weather scare you from taking a walk around the cobblestone streets of La Petite France, the oldest section of the city and the most photogenic, where millers and fishermen once sold their fare in the medieval houses that still stand, the Strasbourg Cathedral, the 17th century Barrage Vauban, and the Baroque Palais de Rouen are great places to visit in winter. They're particularly stunning in December when decorated in Christmas lights, but they're also a great indoor escape all winter long. Number 11 Venice, Italy, Venice could shock you as a colder time of year objective, however there's an explanation it frequently makes the best 10 winter records. When the colder months show up, the travelers leave. This implies you for the most part get the languid roads, Piazza San Marco, and the extensions on the channel to yourself. Simply make sure to visit before the final part of January, as that is when Carnival starts off and things get going and costly once more. At the point when the channels aren't frozen, you can in any case get a gondola ride, simply wrap up under a thick cover as you ride on the dim waters. During December, Venice's biggest square is transformed into a huge ice skating arena. Number 10 Bergen, Norway 
Arrive in Bergen in January, and you get a few magical things all packed into one. Colorful wooden buildings covered in snow, breathtaking views of the fjords covered in icy mist, and a chance to catch the northern lights dancing over the city. Bergen's Pure Harbor is a joy to investigate slow time of year, as snow covers the fantasy-looking scenes around. Sit at a bistro close to the water to taste some hot cocoa and attempt Cannelbuller, Norway's variant of a warm cinnamon roll. Then, at that point, take the funicular to the highest point of Mount Floyen for a dynamite view over the whole city. Fjord travels run all through the whole winter, and there's really no more excellent method for encountering the tranquil wizardry of the fjords than from the water. In addition, the Bergen Mountains around offer a lot of chances to attempt cross-country skiing, snowshoeing, or sledding. The five-hour climb between MT Ulriken to Mount Floyen is a well-known winter walk simply on the edge of town. During November and December, the world's largest gingerbread town is built within the city of Bergen. And on winter days, when the weather doesn't cooperate, you can get a peek of the country's strong connection to the sea at the Bergen Maritime Museum. Number 9 Prague, Czechia Winter rolls over Prague in early December and lasts well into February, with a dusting of snow regularly covering the old town's church spires and red rooftops, second only to Germany for its great Christmas markets, the city is lively and busy during the second half of December, as tourists from all over Europe come over for some holiday merriment. February is masochist or carnival season in Prague, another great time to visit during the cold months to see a fanciful parade of giant puppets and whimsical costumes. The city that Franz Kafka loved just feels more magical in winter, as ice skating rinks open all around the city, and medieval churches put on classical music concerts for the delight of visitors. If you need a break from the cold Prague evenings, Prague is home to many other attractions, including over 100 museums and galleries, an indoor aqua park, one of the oldest libraries in the world, great shopping, and much more. Number 8 Nuremberg, Germany Christmas markets are a European staple, and few countries do Christmas markets better than Germany. After all, it's hard to beat the blinking of holiday lights in a medieval town, especially under a soft dusting of December snow. The Nuremberg Christ Kindlesmarkt is considered one of the best Christmas markets in Germany. Here, over 100 stalls sell everything from the famous local Roschgoldengel to the traditional Lebkuchen gingerbread against a backdrop of historical buildings. With shopping done, visitors can catch a holiday concert at the Lawrencekirch Church, home to one of the largest organs in the world. Or take a stroll up cobbled streets to the grounds of Nuremberg Castle, then visit the city's toy museum to learn about the centuries-old tradition of wooden toy making. Number 7 Rovaniemi, Finland No other destination makes more sense than Rovaniemi, considered the official home of Santa Claus. A fairy tale place just 4 kilometers south of the Arctic Circle, the Santa Claus village feels like a mix of amusement park and Arctic wonderland, the area around Rovaniemi is a favorite for Northern Lights tours. Over 200 Aurora Borealis displays can be seen here every year, one of the highest numbers in Scandinavia. During these months, bluish, glittering snowdrifts cover everything, providing a magical quality to nature and buildings alike. The Anasvara outdoor area around town is perfect for snowshoeing among snow-covered forests. When you need some indoor time, Rovaniemi offers plenty of icy breaks, including a snow restaurant, an ice hotel, ice slides and castles, plus a warmer break in the form of the Arcticum Science Museum. Number 6 Hallstatt, Austria Hallstatt sits right on the shores of Hallstattersee, full of 12th-century fairy tale churches and quaint alpine houses and surrounded by the snow-capped Dachstein Mountains, equally stunning all year long, Hallstatt really shines when it's covered in snow and ice. If you're feeling up to the task, the best view of winter Hallstatt is from the Hallstatt Skywalk high above town, though reaching it requires a hike not always possible in the depth of winter. Number 5 Abisko, Sweden Abisko is often considered the best place to see the northern lights on a budget. This is because the village has a special microclimate that makes catching the dancing lights on the sky a lot more likely than in other Scandinavian destinations. This means shorter stays are needed, which is easier on the budget. Abisko is also the perfect destination for die-hard winter fans who want to experience cross-country skiing, sledding, snowmobiling, and winter hiking under the never-ending polar night. The world's first ice hotel is also located nearby. Number 4 Reykjavik, Iceland Iceland is at its best in winter, when the alien-looking landscape is covered in blue ice as far as the eye can see. The land of the eternal glaciers, Iceland offers the kind of adventures you can't find anywhere else in Europe. Every February, Reykjavik holds the Winter Lights Festival, which showcases light installations and plenty of outdoor activities to celebrate the last month of winter and the upcoming lighter days. If you're looking to warm up, Iceland is also famous for its many geothermal pools. Where you can soak in steaming hot water under the icy midnight sky, you can catch a train or a short flight to other corners of Iceland, 
where you can do everything from glacier hiking in Vatnajökull National Park to witnessing the 10,000-year-old Great Geyser in action. Number 3 Val Thorens, France Sitting at an altitude of over 2,000 meters with 140 kilometers of pistes, Val Thorens is the highest and most famous ski resort in Europe. The resort is surrounded by dramatic peaks and a blanket of snow as far as the eye can see, great for sports enthusiasts but also truly spectacular to see. For those who want the beauty without the adrenaline, Val Thorens has plenty to offer off the slopes as well. From snowshoeing and winter hiking to more unusual activities such as mountain biking on snow or sliding down the mountain on France's longest toboggan run. You can try an ice driving course or fly down the mountain on the highest zipline in Europe at hair-raising speeds of over 100 km per hour. Or test your true courage with an ice diving experience. Number 2 Bregenzerwald, Austria The Bregenz Forest is the Zermatt of snowshoeing and cross-country skiing. With many kilometers of trails available, chances are good you'll get to enjoy this winter wonderland much on your own, clean air and clear skies mean this is the perfect destination for stargazing and night walks. In fact, the area is known for its snowshoeing trips through the forest on full moon nights. This is a romantic 5-kilometer path better enjoyed under the stars, start at the Zunblockel public house, past fairy tale wooden huts and towards the Alp Hunter Dammel's hut. It's an easy walk on powdery snow illuminated by the infinite starry sky, the towns of Owen Bazo are in the Bregenz Forest and offer easy access to ski trails, sledding, and sleigh rides, as well as winter hiking. There's also plenty of things to do indoors when you need a break from the cold, including museums, galleries, and artisan buildings showcasing local handicrafts. Number 1 Zermatt, Switzerland During most of the year, Zermatt is a sleepy village. Come winter, though, skiers of all abilities descend upon it to take over the 200-plus kilometers of pistes. Zermatt is a haven for expert skiers, with off-piste opportunities and top stations sitting at altitudes of almost 4,000 meters, non-skiers will find plenty of things to do in Zermatt as well. For those who want to try snowshoeing and winter hiking, Zermatt offers plenty of sunshine during the colder months, perfect for a walk in the wilderness. There's also tobogganing and sledding, as well as guided hikes for those who want to discover off-the-beaten-path areas, a great easy trail to try is the 2.2-kilometer walk from Blahard to Fluhelp where you can catch sight of chamois grazing on the slopes and the Matterhorn in the distance. As you can see winter comes in many guises in Europe and I am sure one of these winter destinations has your name written all over it. Thank you for you watching. Subscribe for more content.